Hello, this is Cherie for Just Nailed It. Today is She Modern Saturday. So sit back and enjoy. Today I'm going to be doing a fall nail design that I did here on my swatch stick. I'm going to be I used to use a smushing three different colors of pigments and then putting water decals over the top of them like I did here, not this one. These two. So we're going to get on with it. On my nails already I have my face coat, first in line by Simple. I have one coat of black cream, wet and wild. I'm going to take my nail glue, should have already have done this off camera. I'm going to take my nail glue and put it on all my nails so that the pigments do stick. You don't need a lot of glue. Wipe off as much as you can off your brush. Make sure you get to, up to the, almost your cuticles and your sidewalls. You want the pigment to stick everywhere. This is a really cute suit. I think it's a really super cute design for fall. I have the green leaves from She Modern. Also, the pigments come from She Modern. She just had a sale that ended on the 10th, I think it was, where everything was 50% off. I don't know if there's going to be another one before Christmas. Excuse me while I move the camera up a little bit. So, you gotta wait for the glue to dry. When it does, it'll be clear, not white. I am going to be putting these leaves on my nail. They are green. Put them up the right way. Sorry about that. These are Leafs underscore three solids, and they are green, like I said. I've already got two cut out. And my uh, canvas over here, these are just off to the side. Just right yet, we are going to be using three pigments, the Red Dark Pearlescent Shimmer. A really pretty color it is dark a gold sunshine iridescent sparkling um i don't know if anybody else has had this experience with this but normally you got to tap these to come out when i first opened it and used it this poured out of here the the hole is fine you know small but these pigments are so fine i don't know if it's just like these but these other two or any others i've had to tap to get them out maybe this time when i do it it'll be different but when i very first opened it it, it it came out fast my green is green dark pearlescent shimmer and let me see here i'm gonna put these on my palette oh yeah see it just poured out you gotta watch it with this one it pours right out of the bottle. I guess I should bring that up to Tina. Maybe on that one make the hole smaller because too much pigment is coming out and a little goes a long way. I'm going to be doing four nails here. I took a makeup sponge and I cut it in half lengthwise. And this is what I'm going to be dabbing with to put on my nails. I always start with my... <clears throat> baby finger first, my pinky. I need a drink. Excuse me, I'm parched. So a lot of talking does to you. I'm just going to dab this. Dab the sponge and the pigments. And I'm going to randomly dab it on my nail. different nails. We're going to do all these at the same time. I do like the gold, but man, that came out fast. I'm just going to take the sponge, because I did not use this was dry sponging. I did not use no polish on the sponge or water, nothing whatsoever. So I'm just going to wipe it off on my paper towel. And so far you can see 
bad on my nails. One of my lights burnt out like five minutes before I was ready to film. So, I hope you guys can see. I do think this is a really super cute design. Me and uh, Pumpkin's Nail Station were talking about this last night. And this is kind of basically her idea. And she told me, go ahead and use it. She didn't mind. We all, you know, she does a lot of gel polish videos. Um, I've done swatches of gel but not on my nails. Um, that's another video. We'll save that for later. The pumpkin kind of came up with this design, or idea, I should say. And, um, yeah, we're giving it a try. We're going to go in with our dark green now. Dab it on in a couple of different places on your nail. I think I need more green. And I don't know if I've got enough sticky left on my nails for the green. So I'm just going to dab this all over, hoping that it's going to stick somewhere. Whoops. That's the red. I'm going to pick up the last of the sh pigment for the green. gonna dab it all over my nail. I'm gonna take the other oh I'm sorry if I wasn't on film I wasn't looking. I'm gonna take the other end of my sponge and just dab it on it. Just dab it. Just kind of setting it in I guess you could say. Now for your under your sponge here that's got pigment all over it you don't need to throw it out. Take some sharp scissors scissors excuse me cut the end of it off throw it away. You still have a great sponge to use. Cut off your other end as well. You still have a sponge. You don't need to use the whole entire sponge. It, it would be senseless and wasteful. We'll set that canvas off to the side as well as our sponges. I'm going to put a... First, I'm going to put some water. I have a little water bottle from SheModern.com. And I'm going to put some water on my decals. One of them has flipped over on me. Whoops. Let's use some tweezers. There we go. I'm just going to put a drop of water. Let that sit for maybe 10, 15 seconds. I'm going to put some wet and wild clear coat on my nails. Just lightly. You don't need to put like as if you're doing um, sealing them or anything. Just a light coat. This one I use for all my pigments. I keep this separate from my others. I don't use it for my other nail art, sealing nails, top coat, or anything. I use it strictly for She Modern pigments. With the water, whoops, the water decals only take, I don't know, 10 to 15 seconds. It doesn't take them long at all. Dab it down in there. Wait just a few seconds. Oh, I did trusty little note here. This is a great piece of advice. I do cut slits into my water decals. My nails are curved. They have a C curve on them somewhat. My nails are not flat. So a decal will stick better if you cut a slit in them before you apply it to your nail. I'm going to be putting these on my ring finger. And I need another drink of water. I'm 
very sorry about that. But here's how these nails look right now. I hope you can see. I think these turned out really well. Did this one last night. It was like my test on my own nail. I couldn't decide if I wanted to go with the clear nail with the pigments or the black. And I think it turned out really well. Our decals are ready. Like I said, I'm putting these on my ring finger. Get your tissue, jab it down into place, there is that one, I'm going to get my other one here, oh, there was one of my dogs. should be sleeping. It is 6 o'clock in the morning here in Michigan. I am up by myself and this is when I like to do my videos. This is when I'm up alone. This is my time. And there we go. What do we think? Can you see? I think this turned out whoops, really super cute. It's really super easy to do. Very inexpensive because these pigments they come for in a package for a little under $30, somewhere around $25, I believe. Um, they will last you months and months and months. You, you only need a little bit when you do a manicure. And it's well worth the money. I really hope you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below, please. If you are a repeat subscriber follower of mine I greatly appreciate you being here if you are brand new let me know so because I do appreciate that send your friends over let them check out a few of my videos and see what they think I appreciate new subscribers right now I'm taking my Pro FX quick dry and I am capping off, not capping off top coating my nails Make sure you cap your edge. Seal that design in. Once down the middle. Once down each side. Back down the middle again and cap your nails. This one is my stubby nail. I'm going to top coat this one. I don't remember if I did last night when I was playing or not. To look at the underside of it, I didn't. You can pick this up at Myers, by the way. Great product. Well, there is our finished manicure for today. Hope you really like this. I think this turned out super, super cute. Pumpkin, thanks for the idea. I greatly appreciate it. And if you have any Shimon and products, you can try this out and tag me. Let me know. Share it with me on Instagram. I am nailed at 67. Or you can email me a picture at nailed at 67 at gmail.com. I will leave those down in the description box for you to get a hold of me. And like I was saying before, please subscribe to my channel. It is and always will be free. I do produce... Three, I try to do three videos a week. Saturday is always my She Modern Saturday, as you see. So check out those other videos. Have a blessed day. Thank you.